What's up, guys? It's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Unova Red walkthrough. Okay, so in our last episode, we went to the Karate Dojo. We, I think we managed pretty well against these uh, Karate Dojo guys, and, well, we got ourselves a throw as a prize Pokemon. I I'm only assuming we are going to get Sock at some other point. Now, in this episode, we could be going to Sabrina and actually battling her for another badge, but I decided against that. We're going to be going, uh, yeah, we're going to be capturing uh, legendary Pokemon because, uh, yeah, why not? Yeah, we're going to be capturing uh, Tornadus and Thunderous. Now, this is my second attempt. It's not because I failed to capture the Pokemon. It's more of it wouldn't let me capture the Pokemon. Probably because I filled up on my PC, which is really, really annoying. Completely, like, we, we keep on forgetting that this is Generation 1. And your Pokemon just doesn't automatically go to a PC box. It just, you know, it goes to the assigned box that, or the last box you use. Uh, another thing, too. Let's see. What did I get? Oh, yeah. I got myself a lot of old uh, Great Balls. So this is going to be a tough, tough, tough uh, battle right here. And I also forgot that, oh, yeah, Gigalith is a flying-type Pokemon. Yeah, I have the HMO2 fly, so... <laughs> Yeah. So, anywho, let's go ahead and uh, go ahead and uh, play that Poke Flute. As you can probably tell, guys, I am dreading. I am dreading trying to capture this guy because, uh, well, I don't really have the the best of luck against uh, the best of luck against uh, what was it called? Uh, legendary Pokemon. It really bugs me. Okay. So here it is. Tornadus has woken up and is attacked in a grumpy rage. I didn't know it was asleep. And, well, here it is. Tornadus ready to go. And, well, level 30. Now, we're just going to we're gonna try and hurt it because uh, Tornadus does have rest. And it will try. It will fall asleep at some point. It's just we need to weaken this guy. And that right there was a critical hit. So let's go with one more hit. And see if it actually works out. And there we go. Now we got to just weaken this guy, and well, there is a confusion. Now this Pokemon is pretty strong, and well, it didn't affect it. God dang it! Come on, man, put it to sleep. Yes, okay. So we do have a chance. My first chance, or my first try against this guy, it was a little, it was a little tough because he woke up right afterwards, and huh? It turns out that you can actually capture this Pokemon with a regular Pokeball. Okay, so let's go ahead and throw another great ball right here. There we go. Oh, crud. Okay, so there it is. Still asleep. Come on, Tornadus. Oh, crap, Baskets. Oh. Better not use that Master Ball because we kind of need it later on. There we go. One, two. And I'm throwing out that peace sign. <laughs> okay. So I don't know what was I, I, I was worried. So there is Tornadus, the Psycho Pokemon. Tornadus expels massive energy from its tail, causing severe storms. It can blow away houses. Okay. And no, we are not nicknaming this Pokemon right here. Uh-uh. Okay, so that's one down. We have to go to the next Pokemon, which is Thunderous. So I'll be right back with you guys. I'm going to go straight to Vermilion City to, no, to, to the location where this guy is at. So I'll be right back with you guys. Alrighty, guys, so here we are back. Uh, I don't remember what route we are in. Hold on. Let's go ahead and check. See, not really good with remembering routes. So here we are in Route 12, where Thunderous is located. And, uh, well, let's see. We saved up the game. We healed up our Pokemon. So hopefully it goes uh, it goes well, just like the last one. Because that was pretty easy, the way we captured the uh, Tornadus. So here it is, using the Poke Flute. Please, baby Arceus, please help me with this one. And what do we have here? Thunderous has woken up, and, well, it has attacked with the Grumpy Rage. Okay, alrighty, so let's see. Here we have a Thunderous, and obviously that sounds like Zapdos. So we're going to follow the same steps, and that is... Uh, Weaken it and then, uh, oh wow, weaken it and then uh, put it to sleep. Now, at some point, it might fall asleep by itself, and that right there could be, oh wow, that's 
pretty bad right there, so... Yeah, we're gonna have to really knock it out, and... Yeah, we're gonna have to use Hypnosis. Here comes a Thundershock attack. Yeah, oh crud. Okay, so this one is not going away. I thought it would, and... Well, it's using Rest. So let's go ahead and press the speed button. Okay. There we go. And another Psybeam. Hypnosis, and Crap Baskets. Okay, so... Yeah, we're kind of facing a little conundrum right here because Thunderous is going to be... Yeah, Thunderous is... Yeah. Okay, so let's see. Let's go with Mudslide. Alright, let's go with Mudslide and... Ground types. Can it work? Hold on. Can it work? I, I want to know. And then the Bite Attack. And it doesn't affect Thunderous. Okay. Okay, good to know. Let's go right ahead and use a bubble beam. And hopefully that will lower its speed. No, it didn't. So here we go with another confusion attack. And here's bubble beam. And that right there lowers its speed. So now I'm gonna try and capture it with the great ball. See what it what it does. And it missed! Holy shoot! Okay, so that okay. <laughs> I didn't expect that to happen, and, well, let's see, we're going to use a revive. Let's go ahead and use a revive on Gigalith, because it might, this looks like we're going to have to put him on standby just for this one, and, okay, let's go, full beam, and we fainted, let's go straight for Deerling, I'm not going to use the lead seed attack, because that could, that could hurt me, so let's go with a stomp, and... That right there was pretty cool, so it's making this Pokemon flinch. And let's see. Yeah. Let's go with another stomp. Okay, so that does it. And well, let's go right ahead and see what let's see what the Great Ball does. Nope, and that's a miss right there. Miss. Okay. I'm using the speed button, guys, because, uh, yeah, I just, I kind of want to rush it, and, well, there's two Pokemon down. Let's go with Gigalift, and hyp no, Hypnosis, Hypnosis, come on, yes, it is, okay. So there we go, Great Balls, come on. Yes! Oh, so that's how, okay, so that's how it works. You're gonna have to put this Pokemon to sleep in order to capture it, okay. Come on! Don't wake up, you a-hole. Don't wake up. Come on. Here we go. God dang it. Come on. Come on. Here we go. And, yes, we are throwing out that peace sign. We cut ourselves thunderous. Oh, my God. <laughs> and I thought that was going to be hard. So, here it is, guys. Thunderous, the Bolt Strike Pokemon. The spikes on its tail discharge immense bolts of lightning. It flies around firing lightning. Okay, I am not nicknaming this Pokemon right here because that is not cool. Whew. Okay, so that was a little easy. Well, not a little easy, but that was a little nerve-wracking because, uh, yeah, I didn't think that it was. I didn't think I would be successful. So let's go back to Saffron City and uh, let's go ahead and check out the two new Pokemon that we've gotten. So here we are in the Pokemon Center, and well, let's see, let's see, let's go right ahead and let's see, let's see, let's see, not change boxes, let's go ahead and deposit, let's go ahead and deposit this guy right here, and that will enable us to see both these two new Pokemon. So here it is, Thunderous, the electric and flying type Pokemon, it is both, uh, oh look at that, it's best, it's best stat is its speed. Defense sucks, and its attacks right here is Thundershock, Bite, Confusion, and Rest. Pretty good moveset. And then here we have Tornadus, and this guy is just a flying-type Pokemon. Again, its defense sucks, but it does have some pretty good speed and attack. And its moveset right here is Gust, Bite, Confusion, and Rest. Okay, so we got quite a few good Pokemon. Yeah, quite a few good Pokemon. And, well, let's see. In the next episode, I am gonna be I'm gonna be going to the 
yeah, I'm going to be going to the uh, cycling road. I'm going to be battling everybody. Well, not everybody. I'm just going to battle whoever I see. That way we can get to Fuchsia City because, of course, our mission is to fill up this goddamn Pokedex. So thank you guys for watching. I will see you guys next time.